trout rods, salmon rods, striper rods, helmet rods, downrigger rods, lead core rods, spinning rods, and more. If you want a high quality, high performance rod that won't let you down out on the water, go to fishhuntshoot.com and check out our selection of high quality, high performance fishing rods. Okay, I was reeling in my power bait and uh, just taking a break here fishing power bait. I was reeling it in and I was just, just lifting it and dropping it and sure enough a trout took it. So I'm going to let him have it and uh, he's swimming off on it. That's a good tip. You don't necessarily have to just sit there with power bait sitting on the bottom and you can see that fish taking line now. If I engage this, I'm going to have him. You can... Uh, Jig it across the bottom very slowly, and a lot of times, you'll pick up a fish. Just like that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ooh, that, ooh, that's a big fish. Oh, boy. That's a nice fish. He's pulling me all around this buoy here. That's a nice big fish. Power bait, man. <laughs> oh, that's a big rainbow right there. Look at that big old rainbow. Now, I wasn't trolling when I got this fish. I decided to take a break. I wanted to have a soda. Had to check some emails and stuff and uh, grab my spinning rod, put on a little ball of uh, rainbow power bait, tossed it out towards the bank, and uh, not much was going on. I was going to reel in and start trolling again. What I did. I jigged it up a little bit, let it sink, jigged it up and let it sink, jigged it up and let it sink, and I felt dot, 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 and uh, immediately opened a bale, let the fish have it, and uh, got this big old four, four plus pound planted rainbow, man. I'm going to fillet him out, put him in the, uh, put him in the smoker, and uh, that's going to be a nice treat. Thanksgiving's coming up, and uh, I'll have a nice, uh, nice plate of smoked trout for the family. Serve that up with some cream cheese and some crackers. It's going to be excellent. What a beautiful fish. Collins Lake, man, pays off. The big old rainbow. <laughs> Very nice. Howdy, folks. Cal Kellogg here. There is no denying that power bait is absolutely deadly for planted rainbow trout. You saw that big old fish I caught in the opening of this video. That fish gulped down rainbow power bait right out of this jar. But you know, I think, you know, power bait's so effective, a lot of us, we tend to get into a rut when we're fishing it. Standard practice is to bait up a, basically a Carolina rig with power bait, toss your bait out, and just wait for a trout to, you know, find that scent, come along, eat the bait, swim off, get hooked somewhere in the throat, and we got a trout dinner. Several years ago, I was reading an article by Buzz Ramsey, and he advised actually working the power bait along the bottom. Now, Buzz has been with Berkeley for a long time, and he knows a lot of fishing tricks, and uh, that's exactly what I was doing when I caught that big rainbow at, at Collins Lake. I'd been sitting there for 15 minutes or so without a bite, so I started moving the bait along the bottom very slowly, and I probably hopped that sinker up two or three times when I felt a fish take the bait, and uh, I immediately opened the bale, let him run a bit, and uh, it was fish on. And it turned out to be a big old, you know, about a five pound rainbow. 
which is really cool. So just remember that when you're out fishing power bait, if just sitting and, you know, just still fishing with the bait isn't working, try working it along the bottom. Now, if you're on the bank and you're doing that, you're going to you're gonna hang up a little bit, but hanging up's part of fishing. It's a lot easier to do if you're in a boat or a kayak where you can cast into shallow water and work the bait into deeper water. But uh, regardless, it's a good way to draw extra strikes when the fish, you know, they're not responding to a, to a, a still bait. Just that little bit of movement can catch their attention. They come in, they get that awesome power bait scent. They get that taste in their mouth. And remember, once you get a trout to take the power bait into his mouth, they seldom spit it out. It's almost always fish on, and uh, you can look forward to a nice fried rainbow trout dinner. Anyway, I hope that tip helps you catch more fish this winter. I'll catch you next time right here on YouTube. If you're looking for great trout tackle, including some, some awesome spinning rods for fish and power bait and other baits, um, click on over to the Fish Hunt Shoot Production Store. We've got a lot of great gear there at, at very solid prices. And uh, if you haven't had a chance to subscribe to my channel, please hit the subscribe button. If it wasn't for you guys, we wouldn't be doing this here on YouTube every single day. Anyway, I'm Kel Kellogg. I'm signing off.